Yo, yo, I'm Drew Gilchrist and today we are going to check out The Spot. Uh, this is a place that a lot of my English homies have told me to go to for a long time. It's probably the, the place where I've had so many people tell me they know the owner. Um, it's actually unbelievable. But I did go down there the other day just to check it out. But heading down there today for a few special things and to have a little tour. And then we're going to have a second part of this where we do a pure hash doobie because that's what people have been asking me to do for a long time. And I'm finally going to show you guys how I make them. So let's get there. So the first thing you'll notice about this club is there's a lot of space and then you might notice that there's playstations on the wall for like almost every single place you can sit so you with the boys are always going to have a good time chilling in there uh, there's also some nice art on the walls and just generally quite nice vibes um it's nothing too crazy on the interior but the spaciousness and also like just the fact that everyone kind of talks in there and you can talk to people behind the counter it feels really really nice Now this is where the spot really shines, the menu, all right? There is a lot on here, um, too much for me to even go through, so I'm gonna let you guys just have a read of this. So this is the spot. I think I've shown quite a lot of this and there's some crazy stuff here. Like how many PlayStations are there here? Um, we've got two PlayStations, one to five, one to four, we've got two Xboxes. Oh shit. Regular changing fucking controllers because people are just not happy on the competitions. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is jokes. And how long has this place been here? Eight months now. Eight months? We opened on October 15th. Oh damn, yeah, I thought it was way longer than that. No, no, no. Okay. Looks like we've been here for longer because of what we are. Yeah, yeah, I mean the menu is crazy for that length of time. I think you can kind of tell when you like look around and like, you know, you see like there's not crazy amounts of arts on the wall in like yeah, this yeah. part of the, you know, the building, but over the other side there's like crazy amounts of art everywhere and stuff. This is just a new addition. Yeah, that is crazy. Like we're getting these, the new elements. Like and I swear, it, it might just be because I smoke too much Tenko, but is, is the the in the spot the same as the the in Tenko? Is it the same font? Yeah, well, we can't. Because it looks like the same font. The, the <laughs> the in the top of that, it looks like the same font. <laughs> is it? Nah, nah, no, no. The T's are Oh, yeah, it's not. It's not. Yeah, the T is slightly different. It just, just reminded me of it. Coming the same. Though. Yeah, coming the, coming the same, same, bro. Like, you got their whole. You got more of their stuff here than they have in the dispensary in Paris. <laughs> <laughs> um, but what, what do you reckon the goal of this place is? Like, what sort of an audience do you try and captivate from here? We're trying to serve the, the most high grade, clean, clean, medical esque. It's like mm. the top. That's the best way. The top. The top. Mm. All I know is what my, what my friends procure is the best. Of the, best. <laughs> the best. Sick. The best. Hell yeah. We are the only ones who. Continual tanko on a shelf. Oh shit. Continual. Yeah. Well, I think it's one of them ones where it's like, you know, most people out here, obviously they like to, I mean, I don't, how can I put this without, with a way that I can put it so that you can say it online with the police here. Um, most of the clubs here, the tenko is like out of their reach, yes. you know, and it'll sit on the shelves for months, Listen right? Whereas here, we're it just actually, goes. We're replenishing, like, like these are all fresh, these we landed yesterday. We <laughs> got constant replenishment. Oh yeah, no, that's the best way. Um, and I think one of my main last questions for you, uh, before I just have a quick look at, well, I mean, we did have a quick look at some of the bugs, so I don't really have many more questions. But it's just, where do you see yourselves in like a year? Honestly, just progression. Yeah. Progression is the number one aim. So it's not just going to stay the same as this? No, Club's no. always going to look better, have always, better menus? Always got to. Everything's another another arm to the mm. to the uh, weaponry, if you know what I mean. Mm. Like we need we need more defined Instagramming. We need more defined people coming to create an audience. Oh, 100%. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. And actually integrating with the club, and then people just coming off that, literally just just the respect of the club. Mm. Look at the club. Yeah. Look at, look at the stock. The stock is the most important thing in a club. Oh and yeah. And then the next thing is obviously having someone who can host and actually having staff that are in, making people feel loved. 
Oh, 100%. You're not just spending money here. You're able to sit down, chill, and we're part of you. Mm. We, are, we are both sides. No, that's we're, sick. We're friends, family, but we're also the source. And I know you guys are friends with a lot of people as well, because, bro, I have uh, so many people in the UK who are always like, yo, I'm boys with the people from the spot. You've got to go down there. And I'm like, how does everyone know these guys? But like, since coming down here, I realized it's because everyone's so friendly. And if, if you know, you're in the community, then they want to be friends with you, you know? Yeah, like, the best word you said there is the Barcelona is a community. Yeah, oh, 100%. Everyone is there for each other. Everyone knows each other. If you don't know people, you know all the people. Your friend's a friend of a friend. And then all mm -hmm. the friends <laughs> <laughs> that's the best way um oh and one main question well two main questions actually first of all one that i just had in my head which i feel like i should have been asking to the other clubs but i forgot do you have any staff here that smoke pure because a lot of people come from my videos they smoke pure and then they want to know what's the cleanest thing on the menu you know nah, but we have a lot of people that come and smoke pure. so that way you always know what's then, like smoking then, yeah, super white I mean, ash and stuff it's, it's easily not most of us Smoke, smoke hash most of us. Of like, course, yeah. But of the Tenkos, like most of them are proper white hash. Oh no, all the Tenkos were the always be clean. The yeah, the Tenkos were always the clean. The Spanishes though now, the Spanishes are coming correct. Yeah, oh, I've noticed that recently. Yeah, they are really starting the to come. You could have put on a shelf as Cali and nobody would ever have known. A lot of clubs do that out here. <laughs> we're not doing that, you know? Yeah, of course. We've got package, got Spanish and it's top Spanish, that's it. That's the best way. That's it, top um, Spanish. And then what do you reckon, since you've been open, is the best strain that you guys have had on the menu? Ooh, obviously the blue zoosh is always... It's Whenever that comes about. This, and but... you guys get the Nobu batches here as well. Because um, there's the two batches, there's the Nobu batches and the normal batches. I wouldn't even want to say that. I wouldn't even want to say that. <laughs> <laughs> but we definitely get the Zito's fire drops as well. Mm. The Zito's is probably one of my favourites. Mm. The look. Oh, I love the Zito's, bro. Look, when that comes the smell, in, bro. Just that Zito's for me is just amazing. But, to be honest, the Skittles, the, the, the spot genetics that we mm. have, like when that when a good batch comes through, real, real, real turf. That's the best way. Um, and I think we're gonna grab out some hash and I'm gonna show you guys how I do my pure hash joints because everyone keeps asking me, how do you do these pure hash joints? So there's gonna be a part two to this video that's gonna be up at the exact same time as this one. You just have to go on my channel, click on the channel and it'll be there. Um, guys, remember, this video counts as a referral to the club as well. So if, you know, a lot of people sketch out about getting an invitation to a club. If you turn up, show this video to the people there, that counts as your invitation. So uh, don't worry about that. And yeah, make sure to like the video, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and uh, I'll see you guys in part two with the uh, pure hash joint. Um, thank you, my man, it's been a pleasure. Sweet.